seems like every time I start to work on one of these, I spend all my time fixing all the damn bugs in the MIDI specification. Okay, so one of the things about MIDI is it assumes that every key on the keyboard for note is unique. But that's stupid because that depends on the kind of instrument. E even on guitar, it's not unique. So but when you're doing octave rounding, the, the C here and the C, C here is the same. And the way that MIDI usually works is you do, it calls a, a note down, you know, volume, 127, and then when you pull it up, it calls it zero. So if you do overlapped notes where you did down and then down, it would do 127, 127, and then when you pick up one finger, it's zero, even though you still have another note. So what that does is that screws up the trills. So if you have different notes, that's how trill is supposed to work. trills should work the same as the other one just because the same note it shouldn't like not work correctly so I had to change the code to get this to work this is why guitar players can can play so fast because you go on the up and the down and it makes a profound difference um for passages where you gotta play fast show you a demo of one <laughs> players I, I don't know why they put up with this crap because it's like uh, it's like being on guitar and only being able to pick down you, you, this is like an absolutely necessary gesture so um, I have to actually change the MIDI so that if I got one C going down then if I got another one going down I have to insert a note off before this one goes down so that when I pick up the next finger this one will trigger and then there's the same number of downs and the same number of ups. <laughs> pretty before it's starting to get ugly now that I'm starting to fix things that's what always happens with MIDI as soon as you start to fix things it turns into a freaking mess it becomes kind of a pain in the ass to work on all right 